What is going on everyone, this is Wicked and today I gotta apologize for my voice, I just got a cold yesterday and frankly today I'm feeling better so that I can show you how to install and rock the new Pixel navbar on your Samsung Galaxy S8 or S8 Plus. So first of all big shout out for the creators of this overlay for our devices. Zach and Marco Wack, they did implement two versions of this pixel-like navbar, the aligned and the rotate one. You can see the difference between each one of them on the screen right now. The main difference is uh, the home button animation while pressed which looks damn great on both of them. So in order to install those, first of all you'll need to download the APKs. Links of course as always are into description. Bear in mind that this mod works with or without the root, it's just an overlay applied over the stock one from Samsung. So open up a file manager and install your preferred one. Then simply reboot your device and voila, you have your brand new pixel navbar working on your Galaxy S8 or S8 Plus. I zoomed the camera a little bit so that you can notice the animations better of each one of them. The first one is as you saw during the installation process the aligned one. Also, as you can see, in various apps which can color the navbar, the icons turn grey so you can still see them on a white background, which is also a nice touch. I'm currently running Renovate Eyes 5.1 ROM and I did apply the navbar color mode from Rice app. You can check the full overview of the app into the card section if you're interested into it. Now, lots of users are asking how to get it uninstalled, how to get the old Samsung navbar back. Well, being just an overlay, it's really simple to remove it. Just go open up settings app and go to apps, search for this app I'm showing you right on the screen, uninstall it and reboot your device. You'll have the stock Samsung navbar back on your device. Installing the other version of the Pixel navbar is done by following the same procedures. And uh, this is how it looks like. You can notice the difference between the two of them. The little circles on the rotate one are going haywire, making the press of the home button look more agitated. To me, the aligned one looks better and more minimalist, but uh, this is just my personal opinion. Anyways, this was the overview of the pixel-like navbar for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and activate the bell icon so that you'll be notified with all my uploads. I'm Wicked and you can find me on Twitter and Instagram at Let's Get Wicked and on Google Plus at Wicked is here. If you like my video, don't forget to press that thumbs up button and again, sorry for my voice. As always, until next time, take care. Wicked is out. Bye bye.